Well, hi, Bowser. Hi everyone, this is Sombra Medium and welcome back to Super Mario Maker 2. And I'm gonna continue Ross's level, uh, which was called Spin It to Win It. And okay, it's done under 43 seconds by the fastest. So it's not that long. Maybe I am halfway. Uh, but yeah. This time I won't have to spend uh, half an hour learning uh, how to use the controls. I'll have to get back to it because I... I definitely forgot. Oh. Okay. Oh. I think it's the first time I did it that way, but it looks like uh, almost how it's intended. I would explain why the springs are there. <laughs> it's not gonna be a walk in the park. Ah, uh, oh. <sighs> there's something I wonder. All those crosses, like there's no way all the deaths are shown on screen. There would be way more. So uh, what is it? Is it the last ones in this area? Is it the first ones? Does anyone know? Uh oh. Oh, I was so much further for once. Yeah, I managed to go uh, twice further. I'm happy with that, at least. Uh, the sad part is there's going to be more after that. And I'll, like, I'm making it there so rarely that I, I won't be able to train for whatever is there. And, uh, ah, come on. And, and so I'll probably fail immediately and won't reach there until oof, another 20 attempts. <laughs> and yeah, that's going to be the annoying part of that level. Uh, yeah, those things were following me for... Way too long. Yes, that's... Uh, that can last forever. <sighs> it's the first time that happened. Weird. Just because... You arrive at a slightly different time. You might not be able to finish the level. Why am I doing that each time now? Well, now I lost all my momentum trying to avoid doing the same thing again. I tried, but I don't know why it didn't register. Ah, no! And there's more springs after that? Come on! I'll never make it. I don't think I will. Like... The tiny bit of progress I've made shows me I'm going to be in trouble. No! Ah, come on! That was super dumb. Oh, um, for some reason, one of my first jumps didn't work and it screwed me over. 
Well. I'm starting to get annoyed. Yes, I'm starting to get worse too. Ah, yes. Mm. Oh, I should have jumped on that. Tuh. I hate those springs. They're the worst thing they that was in the. They're the first. They're the worst thing in this level. Those stupid springs. Yes. At least I'm getting here a little more consistently. It slid. Mario just slid off the spring. I think he doesn't care about dying. I think he loves it. He's a masochist. I'll never make it, seriously. Oh, look, there's so much more down there. And there's no checkpoint. And, oh, well, I did. I do the same thing all the time. <sighs> Off. <sighs> yeah, I tried to go under, but nope. And going over was too... I would have been too late. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. I think it, it's all about having enough luck so that everything's in place. Ooh. Not sure my Switch is gonna live very long with that game. Once I'll have broken it to pieces, I'll send it to Ross. So, uh... He'll be able to feast on... My anger. Then my frustration. I'm sure that's how he lives. Right? And, oh! I'm, I could have done that. Oh, f ah, I forgot. Really? Do I have to wait for this to go back down? Do a jump on the two ones, but they're gonna be too close. And the thwomp will be too far. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do, and... That annoys me, because it's so far away in the level already. And there's more after that. Uh, oh, maybe I could have done something with that, but I don't even know what. Oh, come on! Oh, that's the first. I didn't even touch the... Mm. I'm getting super mad. I tried. I don't know why he doesn't jump sometimes. Again. Can't I jump from those? Oh, yeah, I can. And I... Uh, might be the only thing I'm gonna do in this episode, but I'll go further in this level. Yeah, and what do I do once I'm there? Hmm. Yep. I can't figure out how to go past it. Oh, I clicked I don't know how many times and he never jumped. Now oh, you jumped there. Mm. 
Again, come on. Okay, you know what? I am going to make a break because this is too much. Okay. <sighs> Had a little 10 minute pause after playing one hour of that same level. <sighs> also had an idea. Not sure how it's gonna work. Uh, but we'll see if I manage to pull it off. I'll need to see. Yeah, that works. Uh, well, <laughs> uh, I guess I should have uh, moved further, but I can I think if I manage, I can go below everything, and that's what I have to do, even with, especially with the flying ones, because um, I mean the two. Flying ones, I can probably go over, but the three, it's too high. Uh, I need to get back into this. Maybe I shouldn't have made this uh, pause. Okay, go back up, go back up. So, shoot. Maybe it's not a solution. I'll insist on that since I can kind of uh, consistently end up there. Well, not consistently, but more often than when I started. Okay. <gasps> I'm not sure where I was supposed to be there. But it seems to be kind of working. I think I have a chance more chances actually by doing that than what I was trying to do earlier. Hit twice there. Yeah, this one is always uh, not synced correctly and because of this one I'm in a bad position for the next one I think it's well this one is constantly there I don't know what I mm. I can't jump over it, it's too high. Oh, come on. Uh, there's some level of anticipation in this level that I can't uh, get to. Because basically deciding if you want a long or a short jump uh, you have to do at the moment you hit the ground. Uh, but with the springs moving all around, and I'm like, I'm still watching the previous spring when the next one comes in. It's. And I don't decide when I hit the ground because that's dependent on my previous jump. It's there's so many parameters. It feels like I have to wait basically, like try until everything comes into place. But it doesn't feel like it's ever gonna come up. Okay. No! Oh, that one hurts. 
I'm not sure I'll have that opportunity much more often. And I don't even know what's after that. It's gonna be worse. <laughs> ah, sh mm. And now the other side. Oh yes, of course. No, I've been too slow. So when I go too fast, I hit the thing and then uh, there's no way. Why did I start to do that? Not even, I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. What am I touching? I'm touching the shadow of it. I don't... Wow. No, no. Oh, I was supposed to make a small jump and then a big... How can I know that in advance? I already forgot what I just did. Okay. So. No. It's normal jump, short, high, high. Normal jump, short, high, high. The problem is I need to think about that when I'm there. There is um, a tiny amount of progress made. Like, uh, I think I'm going at the pace of... Uh, a crippled ant. Well, I don't know why this time it didn't work. And it, it, it happens, which makes me tell what it's there's some randomness to it. Okay. Okay. So. Oh, I slowed down. That hurts. I was, uh, I was almost there. I don't know where, by the way, but further. <laughs> Why is there no checkpoints? Like the most obvious would have been right here. Could have put a checkpoint right there. All right. No, no. I don't have time to remember. It's like there's too much before. And it's taking all my brain power, if you want to call it like that. I think I'm the only one who died there. I don't know what that was. Well, if at least you ejected me in there, that would be cool. All right. I already messed it up. Yeah, well, I, I, I just can't. I, there's no way. I'm not sure I'll replay it. I can't. It's. It's too much. Let's go with this one. It seems easy enough. Slide and jump. And I like sliding. When there's no... Spinny jump involved. Yep, that's easy enough. Why? Okay. Okay, that's a little tougher. Oh, okay. Cool. Uh, 
Uh, I messed it up. Um, okay, I was going to say, how long is it? <laughs> uh, way better. Way better. Anyway, I'm going to stop the level here because I don't want to get crazy anymore with uh, Ross's level. I'm not sure I'll get back to it. It's just too tough. <laughs> Uh, and again, it's one thing I hate in levels, it's randomness, and I didn't play his other level, the one with um, the Yoshis, because it was too random for me, and here it's, it's not exactly random in the sense you can kind of control where the springs are, uh, depending on when you manage to make them spawn in, but it's too many parameters at the same time. Because basically you have to avoid the first springs and move the screen so it makes the other ones come in and depending on that they won't be in the same position and you will be or not be able to avoid them depending on that. And then you have to also manage your position on the thwomp to, to get out of there before you get smashed by the other one. And then if you dare to manage to do that there's this jumping on pennies but even if you know how to do it you f you can't be focused on that when you come there i don't know it's i mean some people have completed it so it's possible but i'm not capable i can't i'll probably come back to it but I've spent two hours on that and I couldn't. <sighs> anyway, thank you all for watching. I will see you in the next video. And goodbye. This one's gonna be horrible to edit.